Hello and happy holidays! In this video I'll be adding some LEDs to my ugly Christmas sweatshirt here to make this Disco Santa even more epic. So what I'll use is some colored LEDs, some maker tape, some coin cell batteries, and I'll just need a pair of scissors. The first thing that I'll do is lay out where I want my LEDs to go. So let's see, I want to have the rays enhanced by the same color that they are. So I'll put some LEDs here. And then I think I'll light up the speakers. So I'll put the white LEDs in the center of each speaker. And that'll make a nice little composition of light, I think. The next thing that I'll do is I'll test how many LEDs I can put on one battery. So what I'll do is just connect the long leg to the positive side of the battery and the short leg to the negative and then it'll just light up. So if I keep adding LEDs and see how many I can fit on here. Oh, getting low. I'm getting dimmer. Okay, the white ones aren't lighting up, so. I think I can get away with this circuit, so I'm going to do four LEDs here on one circuit. And then let's see if I can get four white ones to light up on a separate battery. One, two, three, can we do it? Four, yeah, I think so. That's good enough. Alright, so I'll put a second circuit here. I will take my LEDs and push them through the front layer of fabric so that I can put the circuit on the back side or the inside of the sweatshirt. I also find it handy to put a piece of cardboard inside the sweatshirt when I'm working with the LEDs. That way I don't accidentally put it through both the front and the back of the sweatshirt. And it just gives me something to hold on to as well. The LEDs have a long and a short leg. The long is positive and the short is negative. And so I like to put all of my LEDs through the fabric with the long leg on top and the short leg on the bottom. That way I can think of it as ground or negative is going down and positive is going up. And that way when I have the sweatshirt turned inside out and the legs folded flat, I can remember which is which easily. So I have my positive long leg up, my negative short leg down to push through the fabric. And I'll repeat that for all the other LEDs. I'll add the white ones in the same way. Now I'll fold the legs flat on the back side of the sweatshirt. So I'm pushing down and then turning it over and flattening the legs. And I'll keep doing that. You actually can do it with your hand inside the sweatshirt if you want. Now the positive legs have been folded flat inside the sweatshirt where they're going up and the negative legs are going down. So if I turn this inside out, they're all more or less going in the same direction. And that'll help when I'm laying out my circuit. So I have my four interior LEDs that will be one circuit and my four exterior LEDs that will be another. What I'll do next is add a little bit of maker tape to each of these legs to make them easier to connect. So I'll take about an inch and I'll just place it around and then I'll fold it over. I'll connect the negative legs together first with some maker tape. And I'll use some extra pieces to reinforce my connections. To connect the battery, I'll take a small piece of maker tape and make a loop. The loop should be smaller than the black ring on the back of the battery. I can stick the loop to the battery and then place it on the negative piece of tape. So this goes to all of the negative legs of the LEDs. Now I'll make a path over the top of the battery touching the positive side to all of the positive legs of the LEDs. Again, I'll use a piece of maker tape to reinforce those connections. So now I'll plan the outer circuit. I have the four LEDs here, and in this case I have a little bit of a tricky situation because my negative legs of this LED are very close to the positive legs of this LED. So what I think I'm going to do is kind of angle them just a little bit so that the negative leg is kind of on the inside and the positive leg is on the outside. And that way I'll make a trace that connects all of the negative legs in the center here and traces that connect all of the positive legs out here. Okay, so my negative legs are all touching. 
And now I will add the battery. And in this case, I'm going to add the battery down here because it's kind of out of the way. Or actually, maybe I'll add it right here on the corner. Yeah, I'll add it here on the corner. Let me do that. So I'm going to make another loop. And then I'll stick it right here on the corner. That way I can just go over the battery like this with my positive piece of tape. So let me do that right now. Okay, so I'm going over my battery like this. I have my four outer white LEDs connected to this battery. The negatives all connected together on the negative side. The positives all connected together on the positive side. And on the interior, I have my green and red LEDs with all of the negatives connected to the negative side and all the positives connected to the positive side. And I think we're ready to turn the sweatshirt inside out. Oh, that's so much cooler. I love it. On the inside, you could fold the sweatshirt and short the circuit with one of the other circuits. So this is one of the ones that you wanna kind of lay flat or just go ahead and put it on right away and make sure that it's not bunching up too much. Good DJ Santa. Mm, 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 mm. Here's a bonus quick tip to make an even easier light up Christmas sweater. If you have something like this reindeer here who might have a certain nose that could be lit up red, if you're only using one LED, you don't even need maker tape. All you have to do is put the LED through the sweatshirt or sweater where you want it to go. Perfect. Turn it inside out and place the battery in between the two legs of the LED. So now we have a light up nose. And then use just a piece of tape to secure the battery in place. And then bend it flat against the back of the sweatshirt. And there you have it, instant light up sweatshirt.